Welcome to Rundown. It's Wednesday, June 12th. All right, we'll start in baseball. The Angels last night lost to the Diamondbacks 9-4. to Three field goals given up by the Angels. It's usually not surprising nowadays. On the other side, the Dodgers got it done. They put up a couple of touchdowns to beat the defending world champion Texas Rangers by a score of 15-2. to 15-2? Oh, my goodness. Yeah, they're probably going to win this whole thing. Who are we kidding? Big news today in the world of competitive eating. Joey Chestnut will take on Takiro Kobayashi on September the 2nd in a Labor Day one-on-one -on -one showdown in a wiener take all hot dog eating contest. It's a wiener take all because, yeah, all right. It'll be the first time they match up against each other since 2009. It's been 15 years since the two went head-to-head -head in the competitive eating world. News out of the National Hockey League. It looks like our two teams here in Southern California may be getting makeovers. The Anaheim Ducks and Los Angeles Kings reportedly will get new logos and new uniforms in time for the new season. Word on the street is the Ducks may be going back to their old mighty logo. All right, I have no idea. We'll find out probably on draft night in a couple of weeks. We'll see. Uh, but exciting news, right? Everybody loves a good makeover, I, I guess. The NBA Finals continue tonight at 5.30 in Dallas. The Mavericks drop the first two games on the road in Boston. Celtics trying to get a stranglehold on the season as they're en route to their 18th title in franchise history. See if they can get it done. Tip-off is around 5.30. Who, who knows when games start anymore? Just turn your TV on around that time and you'll see some basketball. Stanley Cup Final continues tomorrow. Same thing. We shift the series to the team that does not have home ice advantage. So we'll go to Edmonton after the Panthers won the first two games at home. So the Oilers trying to bring the Cup back to Canada for the first time since 1993. For those of you math majors out there, that's 31 years ago. That was when the Canadians beat the LA Kings to take home Lord Stanley's Cup. Other than that, the Stanley Cup has only crossed the border to go visit the hometowns of the players who've won it who are from Canada in the last, you know, three plus decades. See if the Panthers can keep things going. It is a hockey hotbed after all. That's it for this edition of Rundown. Don't forget, follow me at Eric Pesolano on TikTok. You already know where you can find me because you're watching it here. Check me out on the other platforms also on X, on YouTube, on Instagram, wherever you can type in my name and find me. Go ahead and give me a follow. I'd really appreciate that. We'll talk to you next time. I'm done.